We'll be taking a look at Harmony's Pencil Tool. All right, Pencil Tool can be found right here in the Tools Toolbar. And I'll show you the difference between a pencil stroke and a brush stroke by laying down a pencil stroke and a brush stroke right next to it. Now, if you click the contour editor right here, if we click on the brush, we'll see that the vector points are located on the outside of the brush stroke. So that means you can change the shape of the stroke of a brush stroke. However, for a pencil line, the vectors are located right in the center of the line, which means that you can change the, I guess, the shape, the orientation of the line, while the shape of the actual stroke itself remains the same. Now, the advantage of that can be seen once you start adding texture to the line. For example, I'll take this brush, which has a little slight texture to it, and if we make a stroke like so, that texture now will move around with my line. As you can see, it follows that contour while still retaining that texture. That's something that doesn't happen with the brush tool. Taking a look at the tool properties for the uh, pencil tool, you'll see that it has a lot of the same options that the brush tool does. It'll have uh, this option here to change the maximum size as well as the smoothing. If you don't know what smoothing is, if you uh, increase the smoothing setting here, you'll see Harmony will try to smooth out that line. So you'll be able to control that more detailed settings for changing the size of the taper, the thick and thin of the brush, as well as the smoothing can be found by clicking this triangle option here, as well as the options for the ends of the line, whether it be round or flat, and how it joints, round, miter, and bevel. Here are the custom pencils that Harmony comes with, and at any time you can delete or add a custom pencil by clicking the plus sign here, naming the pencil and it'll get added to your presets. Over here are the function modes for the pencil tool and clicking on them you should be able to hover over and get a slight description, a tooltip description of what the function actually does. If you want to read up more on what these different function modes do simply click the help for online help, search the pencil tool, and you'll, you'll be able to read up uh, what they actually do. All right, that's a quick overview of Harmony's pencil tool.